Francisco to the Ashanti region where transit and truck drivers are being sensitized on road use and axle and police and customs rules in Ghana and the West African sub-region. The Ghana Road Transport Governance Project aims to improve the sustainability and security of the regional road transport system. It is implemented by the Ministry of Roads and Highways with the funding from the European Union. Nana Bwachiyadum has more in this report. The partner agencies and transport sector operators have been working together for the past two years to reduce road transport costs and reinforce compliance with road regulations. The transit and truck drivers are engaged in the harmonization and simplification of transport regulations. Chief Engineer at the Policy Planning Department of the Ministry of Roads and Highways, Ms. Ifwa Ifa, says the European Union assistance comes at the best time to support the update of the driver's regulatory guide. The European Union technical assistance on transport governance program came in good time to support this much needed update of the driver's guide. The overall objective of this EU project is to improve the sustainability and security of the regional road transport system. The components of the project are construction of a new way bridge station on the Tema Beach Road, needs assessment of the Ghanaian road network, technical and economic analysis of identified maintenance scenarios, capacity building for project management, development of a pricing model for transport services, and support for the sensitization program of the NFC. And it is under this support for the NFC that this driver's guide has been updated and being distributed to all stakeholders. She highlighted the benefits the updated driver's regulatory guide would have on road transport. As Ghana commits to deepen its role in regional transit and integration, road transport will continue to play a major role. As such, this driver's guide, which aids in the safe and efficient use of road corridors, is an essential resource. This workshop will have presentations that provides the details of what has been summarized in this driver's guide. And I will kindly entreat you to actively participate in this workshop. Chairman of the Holy Transport Drivers and Training Center, Alhaji Yakubu Abdullahi, said the workshop would help enhance the knowledge of transport operators on road usage. We are here to educate our drivers to know their rights, the right of the driver and the right of the police. A policeman is who is supposed to take a license from a driver from the rank of inspector up west and he should give the driver a certified receipt so that the driver in case wherever he can trace him and find from Kumasi Nana Pwachi Tangkwayado reporting for Joe News.